All right, this is the um, GTD. Uh, it is October 31st, actually, Halloween 2015. Um, got the floorboard off of the passenger side. Actually, ended up cutting away a couple of the bolts or screws. Um, or the wood actually around it to get to them. You can see we still have um, these to get undone, which I'm trying. Um, able to remove them off the side where they're screwed into the wood. This is to give me better access to the frame without actually taking the body off uh, to clean it up and to uh, press proof it, paint it. Um, so I will be doing that shortly. Working on the passenger or driver's side right now, down to just a couple of screws and um, making headway. And I wanted to show you this is just some of the, I can get a sense of the size. This is how much mud I've taken off of the frame so far, dried up mud. So quite a bit. Um, and um, I think it's been there since um, 1969 or earlier. Um, that's when the car was last on the road, or uh, the license plate was 369, so it may have been sooner or earlier than that. At this mud, so it's probably at least 40 year old mud. Um, anyway, uh, just to give you a quick update on the MG. Um, so as soon as the frames cleaned up, I will uh, do the same. I'll match up the color of the frame, do it black for the front as well. So I'll get that cleaned up and um, going all the way to the back here as well. Have some work to do there and get that cleaned up, rust proofed, and painted. And then on to the carburetors, which are sitting in couple of boxes so those will be next and then um, the goal is to have the engine running by spring so um, that's my goal thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned I'll keep uh, keep you updated